You know, as kids head back to school, schedules will be very busy for families. It can be tough to find the time to cook dinner or even pack lunches. So on this Recipe Wednesday, we are getting some help. Shannon Smith knows about the busy, busy schedules and trying to fit it all in. She is live at GTCC in Jamestown this morning where she's getting some great ideas, not only for her, but for you at home too. Right, Shannon? That's exactly right, Cindy, and it can be so tempting to throw a frozen pizza in the oven or order pizza. Instead, just make a pizza salad really quick, and it's delicious too. Chef Al Romano is going to show you how to make it. Yep. And basically, if you have all the ingredients, prep is going to take just minutes. Right, and you can always order both. You can get a pizza and, <laughs> and have a salad too. But this kind of this you can make the night before and, and put it in a baggie and take it to school. For them or just make it at home. Okay. So, so you're using spinach? Yeah, I'm using spinach. You can use romaine, whatever greens you like. Okay. And you could do it one of two ways. I could put everything in the bowl and toss it, but I kind of like to just put this down and put everything on it because some people, like if you're making it right now, to, to say for Shannon to eat, if she don't like anchovies, I won't put the anchovies on. Yeah, leave the anchovies on. Right. <laughs> so, but plus, it's like pizza. You can make it the way you want yeah, it, what exactly. toppings you want. Exactly. So. I'm just gonna throw, I've got some peppers here, throw okay. on there. I'm putting anchovies on. You go ahead, you can have With this. the olives, these are anchovy stuffed olives. Anchovy stuffed olives, okay. And some tomatoes, I like putting a couple of tomatoes on there. And then you can put uh, some fresh basil, well, you throw it in good. there. Yeah. And pepperoni, you gotta have pepperoni. Yes, you just do a little chopped pepperoni. And some onions, and then Mozzarella. cheese. You got a cheese, you can put Parmesan cheese in there too. Some mutts, and uh, you could, Croutons are an option if, yeah. you, if you want, you know, go strictly uh, keto. Yep. Just go without the croutons. Okay, give us the dressing. We had about a minute to do okay. that. Okay. Okay, so throw a little garlic in there, some chopped garlic. Okay. Some extra virgin olive oil, a little white vinegar, salt and sugar, a little bit of that, a little bit of oregano. Mix. Smells really good. Just mix a little bit, mm -hmm. and then it's going to add a little bit of tomato sauce. Just so it doesn't have to be bit. homemade. Just a little bit, probably about eight ounces or so. Mix it in there, get it a little emulsification going on. That smells good. Yeah, it tastes just like pizza sauce with, with a little uh, dressing. That's a great idea. I really like it. And you can even use a little balsamic vinegar if you wanted to use that instead. Yeah. And just kind of pour it over the top, and boom. There you go, pizza salad. Pizza salad. That's so, wonderful and can be made in a ton of different ways right. using a lot of different ingredients. I love it, quick and easy, yeah. a little more nutritious than calling for the delivery or Al said you could do both. Sydney. You gotta do both. I gotta do pizza, you know, my favorite food. <laughs> yeah, I know, it's delicious. So, yeah. Oh man, I, I, that looks so, so yummy. And it was so fast too. All right, Shannon, yeah. thanks so much.